underpinned by connectivity, the vehicle becomes a real living entity and the possibilities of what a car might become are endless. Exploration means finding the questions to ask and then look for those answers. I'm driven by how the human behavior intersects with technology and how I as a ser service designer can use that as a design material and create services that create value. Postal was the first car to have Google Automotive Services inside. The connected vehicle is clearly a trend that is here to stay and what we need to do is to explore how can we work with this. Exploring with the methodology from design thinking and service design helps us predicting the future. We can't do everything ourselves and this means that the ecosystem is continuously growing and this is the future to design for service ecosystems rather than for a specific car or technology working together cross-functionally in the, in the organization, but also sometimes in a grander ecosystem of, of uh, organizations. The car is only used 5% of the time, which means that it's an unused resource for 95% of the time. Imagine what we could do with all that time. What we have is a car that is connected, and we also have a platform that invites people to develop for the car. The future may well be fully autonomous. It means also that we can expand the usage in terms of moving into a, a third room, an extension of the office or an extension of the home. What we will give you is a continuous update of the software. One of the benefits with the over-the-air updates is that you don't need to go into the workshop to get a software update. From a sustainability perspective, it lasts for longer. We talk a lot about innovation all the time, but in my opinion, innovation is just a product. How to get there is through business design, and it's the only way of achieving that. The opportunities are endless. It's the imagination that limits us. I think it's so interesting with the limitless connectivity because it's something that we now expect. The methodology that we use is to, to disrupt and to look for new answers, which is super interesting, especially from a service design perspective. I imagine a future where nothing is technically impossible.